These two snake species are often confused in snake identification groups on social media. They are both very common snakes in the south that may look similar, but they actually have quite a few differences. The snake species I'm talking about are eastern copperheads and corn snakes. In fact, it was this post of a misidentified corn snake on Facebook that helped inspire this video. So let's take a look at five physical differences between the eastern copperhead and the corn snakes. Then we'll do a deep dive on some of the characteristics that are not apparent in these two snake species. So let's get started. One of the easiest ways to tell a copperhead snake from a corn snake is by its skin pattern. Copperheads will have hourglass saddles when seen from above, but will have Hershey's kisses on their sides when seen from that angle. Meanwhile, corn snakes have square or oval blotches on a much lighter background. As you can see here, copperheads will have a solid brown or copper colored head, which is often much larger than the neck because of the venom glands. But the narrow skull of a corn snake will have a pattern on its head which looks like a spear point or a narrow head. Copperhead belly patterns will be cream colored with dark brown blotches on the sides. Whereas corn snakes will have a bold pattern that is chalk white and black resembling an incomplete checkerboard. Copperhead snakes have heavily keeled scales, which means that each scale has a ridge right down the center, like this. Corn snake scales have no keels, or are just slightly keeled. This gives their scales a smooth and shiny looking appearance. Think of it like this. Corn snakes have glossy or semi-glossy finish, but copperhead snakes have a matte finish. Copperheads tend to have a thick and chunky body shape that can occasionally reach four feet. While corn snakes have thin and slender bodies that can almost reach six feet long. Copperheads will often have vertical pupils, but under some conditions, they may look round. Corn snake pupils will always be round. Corn snakes lay eggs, but copperheads give live birth. Copperheads are venomous snakes with fangs that deliver a toxin to help it disable its live food and to discourage predators. Corn snakes have tiny teeth that help them catch and hold prey as it is constricted. Baby copperheads look just like the adults but have a bright yellow tail. But baby corn snakes have a less colorful adult-like pattern. Copperheads mostly hunt on the ground while corn snakes are able to climb high into trees to look for food. Copperheads are pit vipers that can sense body heat, but corn snakes find its food by following scents with their tongue. It's important to keep in mind that both copperheads and corn snakes can be very defensive when first encountered. If you enjoyed learning about the differences between eastern copperheads and corn snakes, please tap the like button and have a great time enjoying and observing these and other local snakes.